Zach, your girlfriend just moved in with you. Yeah. Very that recently. Is big news. How's it going? Are you enjoying living together with someone? Else? I like it so much. It makes like. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. I'm so excited. Every night is like feels like a sleepover cuz it I mean it is. Yeah. And and uh but uh she brought stuff with her. Uh mostly she just brought like clothes and normal stuff, but she brought stuff because my girlfriend hosts um a documentary show where she interviews people from different sexual subcultures. Yes. And the point is sort of to demystify and destigmatize different weird little sexual worlds. Mm -hmm. And she recently did an episode about something called monster erotica. Are you guys familiar with this? Someone is. You mean yeah. that, you're, that you're attracted no to people dressed as monsters? Well, it's literary. So it's like, it's, it's mostly like these sort of sweet middle-aged women in the Midwest write these stories that are like incredibly explicit about like werewolves ravaging women from right. the Midwest. Or like there's one called Frankenstein's bitch. <laughs> Where I think like Frankenstein like tag team. So anyway, it doesn't right. matter. But the, <laughs> it, they're very graphic. And so she was doing a, an episode about this. And as part of the episode, she interviewed a woman who makes monster themed sex toys, which are also apparently very popular. And when she was coming out to move in with me, she she had to bring some of the objects from this because she was going to shoot them for her show. Yeah. So TSA stopped her and <laughs> and they pulled out a, a dragon. <laughs> and uh, and they were like, "What's this?" And she she was like, um, "It's a dragon." <laughs> and they were like, "Okay, but we're gonna have to confiscate your water because it's more than four ounces." Like, <laughs> they didn't. Well, this is fine. Completely. <laughs> <laughs>